Americans choose ABC News to see the whole picture. Hello to our fans online. I'm Ty Hernandez. I'm John Muller with the top stories this Monday, June 10th. Jury selection beginning today in the high profile trial of neighborhood watchman George Zimmerman. 500 prospective jurors from the Orlando area will be questioned by lawyers from both sides. Zimmerman's charged with second degree murder for killing unarmed teenager Trayvon Martin. He is pleading not guilty. He insists the killing was in self defense. The headquarters of the International Military Force in Afghanistan has come under attack. Afghan police and military units rushed to the area early this morning after several explosions and gunfire were heard. NATO's headquarters is at the main airport in Kabul. It was closed to civilian air traffic because of the attack. Afghan officials say all the rebels involved in the attack were killed. 29-year-old high school dropout says he is the source of those leaks about the government's secret surveillance programs. Edward Snowden claims to have worked at both the CIA and the NSA. He says his sole motive was to let the public know what was going on. Snowden had worked in Hawaii, but he left for Hong Kong in May. He has been there ever since. And it was a big night for Broadway as the Tony Awards recognized this season's best plays and musicals. Cindy Lauper's Kinky Boots took home the prize for best musical. Vanya and Sonia and Maja and Spike, which stars Gordon Weaver and David Hyde Pierce won for best play. I love it. Mike Tyson and Neil Patrick Harris dancing on the same stage. You know, that and, was a moment. And it worked. It all worked. It did. It was really good. <laughs> More news anytime at ABCnews.com. I'm Ty Hernandez. I'm John Muller. Thanks for watching. This is World News Now, available anytime, anywhere you want it.